I'm so bored. Wait, what is that city? Hmm, I don't know. Let's see. Wait, what are those colors? I mean, it looks like a rainbow. Hmm, I've always wondered how rainbows are formed. Anyways, let's watch it. I've been curious for a long time about rainbows and I'm sure that most of you guys ignore how is it formed. But let me tell you a secret. The white light is made of seven colors. Red, orange, yellow, green, blue, indigo, and violet. This is the key to understand the story of a rainbow. It all starts with refraction. The white light passes through two different transparent mediums, for example, air and water, and then it changes its direction. That's because the light slows down when it enters water, therefore the beam is forced to turn. In addition, each color of the white light has its own speed. Violet light moves slower than red light, so it will bend more as it enters water. So an incoming beam of white light will be opened out then separated into a colorful light spectrum. This is what we call dispersion. Here's an experiment to prove it. We are going to need a source of white light, a prism and a white screen. Once the white light enters the prism, it is reflected then reflected back out so you can see it as a spectrum of colors. We can conclude that rainbows are a bunch of outgoing sunlights that have been reflected and dispersed while passing through raindrops that act like prisms. So yeah, that's why we find rainbows only in rainy days and when the sun is shining. Now I know what are those colors on CDs. They are white lights because CDs act like prisms and raindrops and they break the, light, the white lights. That's